Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Shanton. And from Red Mathematics, let's math magic. So, uh, as I was discussing about the uh, various various formats of the straight lines, and there's a little bit more. In this video, I'm gonna discuss about uh, the how to find an angle when two straight lines are intersect to each other. And, uh, how to check whether two straight lines are perpendicular or those uh, th that two straight lines are parallel to each other. Another one formula that is how to find a uh, the perpendicular distance from an external point to a certain straight line. So let's get started. In this video, uh, at first I will tell you the uh, how to find a uh, acute angle between two straight lines when the that two straight lines are inter intersecting to each other the formula is if the angle between them is uh, theta then the formula is tan theta equals to modulus of m1 minus m2 by 1 plus m1 m2 here the m1 and m2 is the corresponding slopes of the uh, straight line 1 and the straight line 2 from this formula you can uh, actually notice that if m1 into m2 is minus 1 then the denominator part that is the denominator of the right side part is actually zero. So the term in the right side is the undefined term. We all know that that is tan theta is uh, undefined whenever the theta is 90 degree. So when m1 into m2 equals to minus 1, then that two straight lines, that is uh, the angle between the, that two straight lines are 90 degree. That is the straight lines are perpendicular to each other. There are another method to find uh, that two straight lines are perpendicular or not. That is, if you saw an uh, equation of straight line in the form that is ax plus by plus c equals to zero, then if you want to uh, what the equation of the straight line which is perpendicular to that straight. Now we will discuss about that how to find the perpendicular distance to some uh, to some straight line from an external point. That is, let the external point be P and the straight line here is AB and the foot of the perpendicular is D. So now we have to find the length of PD. So the formula is uh, let the, uh, coefficient, the coordinate of P be alpha comma beta and the equation of the straight line be AX plus BY plus C equals to zero. Then the formula is PD that is the segment PD equals to uh, modulus of A alpha plus B beta plus C divided by root over of AX square plus B square. That is you just put the coordinate of that point in the place of x and the place of y in the numerator and just uh, square root of the square, sum of the squares of the coefficients of x and coefficient of y and this is unit this is the perpendicular distance from an external point to a certain straight line how we to uh, how to determine how to check that two straight lines are par uh, parallel to each other that is whenever two straight lines are parallel then you just you just note that keep the coefficient of x and the coefficient of y that is if there are you you have uh, there, is, there is given two equation of the straight line and you have to check that whether they are perpendicular or parallel just for parallel that you just uh, check that a1 by a2 equals to b1 by b2 here the a1 and b1 are the coefficients of the first equation at x and y and the a1 a2 and b2 are the coefficient of the second equation of the x and y that you are just to check that a1 by a2 equals to b1 by b2 or not if the equation is satisfied if the condition is satisfied then you will say that okay, the two straight lines are parallel to each other now i find uh, the finally i want to say that okay, uh, whenever you are solving any uh, any any problems of straight the straight line here i am only discussing the two distance Whenever you are solving any two straight lines, uh, the, any problems regarding straight lines, then you just uh, keep in mind that when this there are various types of formula. So which formula you have to use and when the formula is to use. That is, you just uh, check that w w uh, whenever the what what kind of data is given, then you just put the formula as per requirement. That is, if there is two point is given, then you use just the two point form. If the one point and the slope is given, you just use the one point slope form. And if the intercepts are given, then you just uh, use the intercept form. And uh, I in this class, as I told you that uh, how to find the uh, angle between the two straight lines and how to find uh, the if the straight lines are perpendicular or if the straight lines are parallel and uh, here uh, and the how to find the perpendicular distance from the all the things all the formulas i have discussed in this 
that is the whole about the straight lines so you just start to solving the uh, solving the sums and if there is any help, any problem you just face just comment down below and you can message me on facebook you can uh, dm me on instagram and uh, all the links are uh, in the description box below thanks guys for watching this video hope that uh, you have enjoyed this video and if you have any questions regarding this class please comment down if you have not yet subscribed to my channel please subscribe to it thanks for watching jai hind vande mataram keep in touch